Testing. One, two, one, two. Let's see what we got going on. All right, all right. Probably should mute the stream so we don't hit a big old echo in here. What up, Ka? All right. Thank you, Sleepy, for hitting the, uh, the check on. Well, you can see we got plenty of packs here. We're going to run through them. I travel uh, back to the old home base, little old studio here. Hopefully we'll get, uh, I guess, through maybe, say, 50 packs or so. Um, plenty, to, plenty to feed through here, so we might as well just hit it and run with it. Got a little extra time for the holiday break, so figured it would be a good time to get in there. Merry Christmas to everybody. My apologies, I'll be looking back towards the computer to check out the chat streaming from the GoPro right now, so it's a little bit uh, twofold here. Love to see it, love to see it. Merry late Christmas. What up, Juan? What up, Base? All right, well, Soar's going to start us off with a hefty pack. Got a few hand runs in here. A Sive I sent in before as Sook, but had to change my name. No worries. I sent some collab stickers. Feel free to do one. And he's also open for trades. Underscore dot Soar underscore ESP. I think there might be an extra dot in there. But uh, if anybody wants to be the, uh, the note taker here and write down everybody's Instagrams or maybe even drop them in the chat, hopefully maybe you guys can check out some of the Instagrams live because I'm not going to be able to feed them in as we go. But damn, look at that. Got a sweet character on the front. Here's one of those collabs. Super clean. Very, very clean line work. Soar. Loving the stars on that throw. Very nice. I'm going to do my best to make sure uh, we get all the uh, an even look at all these, but um, we'll see what my best posture and uh, center fold looks like uh, as we move forward. Very cool. Loving the kind of metallic green on that guy. Little cat character. Also very clean. Loving, loving him. Soar. E luck. The mop tag on top of the sticker. Very nice, very nice. Got a West Coast style there. So we're on the tags. Yeah, so I figured this would be a fun little live stream. I did the last sticker submissions live and that seemed to go pretty smoothly, honestly. And one little blank to finish it out. It was a fun little session. It's fun to, you know, check out the pack and then also kind of take a look over at the chat and see what everybody else is thinking about it. Try to move that a little closer so maybe I can peek from the corner of my eye as we go through. Won't have to break the mold too bad, but big shout out to Soar. I'll uh, hit his Instagram once more, underscore dot Soar underscore ESP on Instagram. So you guys can go check him out. I don't have a good stash spot for the scene packs. But yeah, we got a nice solid set here. What up from Colorado? How's it going? Serbia? Wow, we are already hitting the globe. But yeah, we've got a bunch of different packs here. Saw a ton of different mailing addresses already, so we will be, uh, I think we'll be a nice, nice spread here. Hit this note to see who we got this pack from. Just had a baby brother. His name is Cam. I will keep sending in more packs. Cade. Right on, Cade. He sent in before. Very fresh pack. Sino, S-I-N-O, Sino. Very cool little uh, hellos here. Um, but yeah, I peeked a few of the packs as I was pulling out uh, um, the return envelopes. So we've got, we've definitely got some heat coming through this time around. Hopefully it'll be well distributed. Ooh, whole set of Avery blanks. So maybe we'll, I was thinking last time I'd hit some blanks uh, midway through, did a break in the stream and actually drew some myself. So maybe we'll do that same here, save some of the blanks I get and uh, get a little speed art in the mix. Cool, fresh pack here with the fluorescent pink and then the yellow throwy on there. Very nice. Thank you very much, Cade. Looks like we got a, a big pack coming in next. 
What up from Arizona and Portugal? Nice, nice. Got some tall collabs here. Ooh, not even collabs, just big busted. What's what we got here? JVJ, maybe an N? Let's try to peek a tag, see what we got. Develop, DV, DLP, Develop sent before. He had some crazy hand drawn characters. Very funky. Loving the harsh style there. Very edgy and large format too. Very cool skull character. Love the two tone there to hit the uh, little gradient. Develop. Bunch of tall ones. Clean throw as well. Yes, here's some of the ones I remember. Character stuff on that skull. And then it, the develop in the eyes. Excellent, excellent choice there. Really a uh, thorough design. You know, didn't leave anything unturned there. Some eggs, nice, nice. A little Aloha yellow. Some more of those skull boys. Flaming gun. I might have actually printed this guy for him. I printed him some 3x4 thermals and don't quite remember if it was that exact design, but close call if not. Ooh, ballpoint pen on the USPS. Very nice touch. Almost a bevel style on this guy. Real sweet. What up, fishy? That final skull boy to finish it out. Very nice develop. Thank you for the pack. Oh, well, last guy there. <clears throat> Almost a blue hue to that skull. Very cool, very cool. Oh, we got a little cap pack and some stickers and a note. Check it out. Hey, Cy, can I get some stickers with these caps? Thank you. Ooh, maybe just a straight up little trade. Kes, K-E-S. What do we got here? Kes 1. So we got some New York skinnies, maybe an adapted Rusto, or adapted New York skinny there. Got the bottom half drilled out, a little blue dot. Very nice, very nice. Well, this is a fun mix. I'll, uh, yeah, definitely drilled out himself. Well, I'll see. Hopefully he sent a return pack in the mix so I can send you a nice little thank you in exchange. I actually got a piece half finished in the backyard right now, so maybe I'll throw some of those in the mix tomorrow. What up, sheep? How we doing? I gotta come to Serbia sometime. The offer's open. I'd love to travel to Serbia. Hey, Sai. Second time sending in. Hope you like it. D-O-X-F? P.S. I ran out of blanks, so it's a pretty small pack. No worries at all. D-O-A-F? Doof? Pretty fresh throw right there. Loving that A. That's a cool one. Little character guy off to the side. Very cool, very cool. Flip the character onto the O. And a drawing to finish it out. Fresh. Bean tags on the bottom. Dof. Right on. Well, thank you for the drawing set. Alright, next up we got at Jin Sano, and the I is our number one. Jin underscore Sano. Big, big mix in here. Oh, nice. We got like a Thrasher magazine hit up with the hand embellish. Jin Sano one. On both sides. Very fresh. Oh, I called it as Thrasher, but that was just good luck there. It says it on the bottom. Big time drawing here. Big gin. Center stage. Yo, Stive, it's been a minute since I sent you a pack. I took a break for a bit, but then I came back and I'm still riding gin and Sano. Hope you like it. Instagram, G, the number one N underscore S A N O, of course. Yes, got the Bruce Lee stencil on deck. Looking fresh. Got the Air Force, Chicago. Nice. Sano 1, 
sweet character, a little beanie atop. Whoa, these are hard to see. Lime green, kind of maybe yellow highlighter on the, the thermals. A little hard to pull off there, but no worries at all. Looks great with the brown fill for sure. Oh, check out, we got a piece. That's fresh. I think I've got markers, I've got alcohol markers to my right, only the little bit of leftovers from way back when. So maybe we'll stash that as a to-do later on in the video. Sano, nice character. Digging that for sure. Little Obey stencil, nice, nice. Psychedelic, I did. I, uh, I've got some footage of it in use as well. So I, uh, the sticker pole that I was so kind gifted from Psychedelic last uh, sticker submissions and I demoed smacking against my wall. I got out and used it a bit. So I've got to produce the video. My, uh, my laptop that I'm traveling with right now that I hope to edit it on just is not good enough to edit the, the footage that I take from my GoPro. So a little delay on the actual production, but hopefully maybe first of the year, once I'm back in uh, the formal lab, I'll be a chance to uh, actually edit that up and, and get that out. Another kind of short clip similar to the 3D session I was running and uploaded the other day. Uh, kind of just a, a quick hit, but I think that'll be a fun one as well. Bunch of mini guys, little side hit ups. Always, always a big thank you. And yeah, I'll throw uh, the address that you guys can send in. I don't, I'm not going to break the stream to do it now, but if you check any of the sticker submission uh, videos, I've got the address that you guys can mail packs in here as well. I've got obviously a bunch of packs ahead of me. Um, and altogether, it's a fun little uh, session to sit down and check out your stickers. So either, either it's stickers or art just in general, whatever works, you feel free to send your, your my way and I'll uh, feature it almost kind of by monthly at this point. All right, we got Alley Cat on deck. Of course, always sending in a, a nice assortment of stickers. That's one way to get up is send in every month and I send these packs back around to the masses. So I've got a stack of maybe 20 or so packs off to the side that I'll uh, fill all these stickers back in and send them to the wild. New stencil, I think, from Alley Cat. Very, very clean. Loving it on the the side shells as well. Oh, even hit the back side. Might be a little hard to see in the yellow. Very nice. Share the love with some fresh slabs. Alley Cat on Instagram. A L I E Y C A T. What do we have? A hefty stapled up blank here with the tag over top. Alley Cat's always trolling a little bit with some funny collabs or combos to go around. That'll be an interesting one to hit. We'll set that aside. Alley Cat, all the staples punched through this poster too. It's funny. I'll tag there. Very much appreciated for sending every month, Alley Cat. All right, we got a, my name is, name? Hey, Sive. This is name was Smokey, but changed my name to Unclear. U-N-C-L-E-R 17. His Instagram is under A-G underscore 17 underscore. All right. Under rage. Under age. Kind of misspelled a little or shifted a little. You know, not always a misspelled, but let's check out what under age sent. Might need some scissors for this. So it's funny how densely packed some of these come in. Ooh, let's hit the clear side. See that under on the egg looks so nice. Try to keep these in order. So we got that purple egg, very fresh, very fresh. Under on the eggs all around. Clean tag. Looks like we got a little sketchy blue on the right side. Very fresh. Big hello fan here. Some assorted color drops, loving it. 
Very nice under. Even a character or two in the mix. Backside is all characters. Very fresh. Ooh, had them right the first time. Right on under. Thank you very much for the pack. Right on, Tiffany. Thanks for the support. As it goes without saying, everybody that uh, throws some love through this shop online definitely helps to keep uh, the sticker videos going strong. This pack is from Serb. Yeah, actually, kind of a soft drop. I just got in some 4x6 holographic blanks um, on the, the side shell vinyls. So those are real fresh, real big size. Um, they uh, A little bit of mismatch, trying to, tried to get some into custom print and just had a heck of a time trying to get those to work so turn them all into blanks at this point um, but maybe we'll have some custom printed four by sixes as well gotta design some up for myself uh, that fit that form factor a little better but excited to, to release that nonetheless um, these are kind of cool eggs got the money sign around the edge for serb and then they got the 100 percent emoji there very cool Serb coming in with the, the bulk buy here. Lots and lots of volume. He sent in a bunch of prints the last set. I think, I'm not sure if those have made it out into the, the mix packs just yet or not. But he sent a fat stack of those little printout guys. Thank you for the support. Very, very nice. Thank you, Serb, for pack round two, I believe. I think you've sent in twice now. But could be more than that. Drowsy Locks, thank you for the support on the 360 degree video. That was a fun one to make. It was kind of spur of the moment. I had some extra paint from, uh, ooh, check it. We got UFO. Had some extra paint from the dang paint review, so I figured I'd make a little special something. Hey man, hope you are doing well in these weird times. Here's some fresh egg cells to spread around the world. Do you play Among Us? Never played, never played actually. Been a little busy and uh, haven't been gaming too much recently. But UFO, holding it down. Look at that. You gotta love the clean blockbuster there on the eggshell as well. Let's see. Let's see how easy these peel to. Perfect. You love to see it. UFO coming in clutch. Always staying. Uh, always staying prominent amongst the strange times, like you said. Instagram omgraph, O-H-M dot graph. And then we got a little spread of maybe some other artists featured in the pack. Chewy Clay, Scheme, Steffi, Blanco, and Impurity. Oh, wow. Look at that clean throw. You love just the extremely, extremely smooth coating there with all the colors. Oh, I'm looking fresh. Apostrophe on the preem blanks and then spotted them to make a maybe a little snowfall up top. Very clean, very clean. Looks like we got some thermals on the uh, the yellows and then some scythe shells on the whites. Loving the, maybe we got the Florida vibes, got the nice orange for the O. Hawaiian vibes with the pineapple. Got the uh, MC Escher vibes with the, or Einstein vibes with his derivative equations. Very nice. Ooh, clean, clean, kind of minty backdrop there. Loving that. Got the other Florida special. Very nice. Clean prints as well. Cool, cool. Oh, can't say I recognize the, the throw, but it is well executed nonetheless. Loving it. A little piece style too. Some splatter greens on top. Collab. Let's toss that on over. Loving the pinks on there. Another one, Omi, maybe for, for long form. A couple of those Supreme eggs. Maybe here's the mix pack of everybody else. Very nice. Some blank boys. Right on Ohm. Love to see it. Well, maybe we got to go check out ohm.graph on Instagram. Uh, and we'll uh, see some more from you. Very creative styling there. I think it's time we hit a big pack though. Got a huge priority mail here. Two sets. Let's see. There we go with the 
hand drawn, uh, almost maybe an orc kind of guy with a spray can. Got the sticker submissions in or uh, PO box right here. So if you want to jot that down or go check out one of the other d Instagram videos, or, excuse me, YouTube videos with uh, the link there, that'll be uh, a way to grab the address while I'm talking. All right, first time of many sticker packs. Been lagging on sending them, finally got around to it. Well, gee, we got a hefty set here, so no worries. All stickers are hand-drawn. Looking forward to get some dope ones my way. I'm going to collect the art and frame it. Very nice. Wu-Tang Forever and God Bless. P.S. All the names in the pack is all my family, and I like to practice different names. Oh, that's kind of a fun way to do it. Good stuff. Yeah, that's a good way to switch it up. Just practice everybody else's names. You get the whole whole alphabet after a while. So it looks like we got Gila to start. G-I-L-A. On that liquid chrome, you can see just perfectly metallic. That's fresh. ESO, ESPO, maybe ESPO. Stiffen a lot in there. Very nice. It's always crazy to see how much detail someone can squeeze a piece into a little hello. Some more liquid chrome. Some eggs on the hollows. Gonna take it this man's a fan of uh, some metallics here. Lots of it. Lots of it. Ooh, some blacks. Fresh. Couple blanks in the mix. Always nice. And we got that Wu Tang. ESPI. SB. There we go. Misread it to begin with. Whoa, check out how dark the backdrop is there. Adds a super matte contrast. I'm digging that. Fresh. Even stretched out those pieces. You know are Gotta look nice. Very cool. What up? Hulk King Dope 1. Juver, your pack's in the mix. I'll uh, I'll hit that very soon. I definitely saw it while I was unpacking the, the return sets. Very, very nice mix pack here. Oh, you gotta love the red on the priority. Very fresh. And then what might we have from uh, pack number two here? Ooh, maybe some collabs. Sticker pack TWO. Number two. Gila. Ooh, loving that pink on there. Very fresh. Little character in the middle of that collab. Got a long one here. Quadded up. Loving that. Very fresh style on the kind of brown and gray coloring. Not a common color set. We got Heaton. He Heather. The lowercase h. Very cool. Ooh, the side hit up in green. Very fresh. Thank you, sir. I'm eager to see. I'll flip through these, see if any of them catch my eye. This big one in the back has already got my attention, though. Look at that. The octopus character, scuba man, so fresh. A little mix of paint marker and alcohol as well. And we got the full set here. Very killer set, very, very fat back. Thank you, sir. No formal tag, he said he just tagged to mix the names. So I don't know who to thank directly, but I think you know who you are. Okay, we got uh, maybe a note up front. Yo, Sav, I love your videos. Nine years old, uh, and I've been graffiti artist for years from. Artist for four years, maybe? VXT Crew, and then Cruis, Cruis, C-R-E-W-S. Let's check it out. Cruis. Cool little tag there on the hellos. Another Wu-Tang back-to-back. Some uh, characters as well. Very nice. 
Cruise one. Loving it. Ooh, fresh on the fluorescent pink. Very nice, very nice. Well, Cruz, thank you for the set. Little character across the triple up. Very fun. Much appreciated for the pack. Is there a side Discord? No, I've never made one. Is that something that would be of value? I don't really know anybody that uses Discord in that manner. More just a personal chat, but is that something that might be fun to maybe trade stickers through? Hope you enjoy, Mr. Roger and friends. Love the work, keep it up. Mr. Roger coming in. Mr. Roger action figure. Got a little, maybe a, a Mexican character here with, I'm not sure, maybe some incense or something in his hand. I don't know the accessory there. These are very fresh vinyls though. At Mr. Roger, or Mr. Underscore Roger 56 on Instagram. These are sweet stickers too. They're like a hang tag. That is something I haven't seen before. Very, very unique. Got some uh, New Belgium Brewing stickers. Maybe serve as a good blank backdrop. What do you want me to do? Little street side uh, telephone pole hit up. Ales K4P. We got a crew there. Dumpster. Ooh, this might be a little sign. Very fresh, a little big character. Hand drawn. Yeah, definitely hand drawn. A little fold out. Rolling down the street. That's fresh. A little big characters all the way. Crazy LA hit up there. Very nice, very nice. Some more brewing. Group D Doc, fellas. Very nice. Oh, fact. Love the pack. Awesome stuff from Mr. Roger. Thank you for the set. Need a breath refresh. Let's see what we got next. Oh, I see a pack from Archive sitting in the side here. In the wings. Got some retro stuff here. At failed to listen Zion. Right on, three kg, three kilograms. Oh, a little Oktoberfest, that was a fun blank to hit up. We've seen those before. Some tags, sticker mule, knocks in. Shins, S-H-I-N-S, -S. pretty funky. Not sure what the double triangle is in the middle, but it looks pretty fresh. Go ghost. Shins. Loving that character. Very cool. Almost, maybe almost like a, a monkey of sorts, but got the fast hair in the back. Not sure. Very fresh. Loving that, Shins. Thank you. Let's hit this archive pack. Ooh, we are losing back left and right. Check out that envelope. Take some dedication. And then the, another interior envelope. Got some cool printouts, some tags, maybe a punk show or something. Oh, this could be a poster, it's hand folded. Archive has one of my favorite Instagram feeds right now. Easy to say, just a massive collage of stickers on there. And he follows suit with an awesome collage style with his prints here. Look at that, we got the spray color in the backdrop then printed right on top. Very fresh. And another zine. Archive. Little mini set here. Very sweet. Love that design from him. Kind of a half, a weird half tone. It's, it's a half tone design, but it's, you know, you're not using normal just half tone dots to make the image. Very expressive. Love it, love it, love it. Archive with the nice glossy vinyls. Very nice. Clean and simple text there. That goes a long way. Got some real mini for these two by threes. 
little thermal guys. Some colored thermals. Here's that design I liked. Yeah, really funny half tone. I wonder how he designed that. Little skull guy. Dreams and the little eyeballs. Got some bigger ones here. Ooh, feels like a... Doesn't even feel like a sticker, just maybe a, a nice printout. Some more frameable art. That's a funny one. Little peephole. Yeah, these feel like just nice kind of almost photo prints. It's fun to see. Archive. What are the chances? We got a little yellow zine too? Or is this a poster? Ooh. Split. Fold was too strong. Nice. A little mini poster there. So hopefully we don't ruin that too much more as it gets sent along to the next guy. Archive. Thank you very much for pack number two to the session. Much, much appreciated. Ruckus underscore art. Enjoy the pack. And we got a nice assortment of some other featured artists as well. Ruckus. Nice print out here. Very clean. Loving the glossy texture. Clean, simple tag. Ruckus. Very nice, very nice. Some USPS. Took a little break. The last few packs didn't have any USPS directly. Ooh, two layer vinyl. A little hard to see that, I'd imagine, on camera, but we got kind of that really soft, deep uh, orange color to complement the fluorescent pink. Beavis and Butthead. We got an RX and Noxin, and then Big Bag Snaw. Blurred and out of his head inside the sleep TV. Very fun set. Thank you, Ruckus. All right, I think we should go dig into that Juver pack. I saw him lurking in the comments in the chat a little bit. Juver Rose always is holding it down. I think I have a pack from him every, every month, if not more frequent than that. At underscore Juver Rose. And we got his AOL. Wow, hit up the little enamel pin. Full color set there. I've seen a few artists do these recently. They look so sick online. Kind of a glossy enamel, kind of maybe even like an epoxy finish on there. And then you get to put your art right in the backdrop. Very fresh. Ooh, we got a, I think I might have to open this pack because we've got a couple in here. Let's get a closer look at some of these buttons. A little piece on there maybe? Very cool, little square button. We got Juver above the world. Very fresh piece. Juver's hands down, has got everything on deck. Characters looking fresh, buttons looking fresh, tags looking fresh. Juver, Sive, visiting, here to stay. Very fresh hit ups, loving these. Ooh, got a little uh, albino character, or maybe a, well, we got a mime going on. Love them. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Big collab. Character set. And then, uh, uh, who's this? Off to the side. Forget his name. Damn. Ooh, Spidey Senses with Absin. Save the kids. Absin Juver. Very nice. We got a little mix pack. Art by Juver. A little blank set. I'll, let, I'll pass that along as is, get somebody the whole set. But we got kind of that paisley front. There we go. Ooh, full time letter. What up, size? This is Juver again, just dropping off some new spooky stickers. Jeez, I might have hit these on October if he's saying they're spooky. I know I've been holding some of these stickers for quite a while. They, uh, I sit in my P.O. box and I haven't gotten around to filming in a little bit. Uh, first, I know you won't get them in time, lol. I send you some custom blanks and a pin. I've seen them now, I love them. I have available in my website if they're interested. Well, good looks. I'll uh, send you guys a link to that as well. It's uh, Art by Juve Rose on Etsy. Very nice. Well, hopefully you guys can show him some support because he is holding down the sticker trades. I have 
Plenty of his work sending out in the packs I mailed. Whoa! Big time poster. We got Weapon. All right, that first collab was from Weapon. Recognize the tag, a little bit larger form. We get a good view of that. Juver, Weapon. Where's this? Uh, maybe Chicago? We got the O'Hare Airport. Very nice. Plenty of room in here. Toss that to the side. I don't know that I have a big enough marker to jump on this right now. But that is heavy collab. That'll be a fun one to send along. Let's, let's see a flip through of the other slaps we got. A little, uh, I don't know, maybe that is a Jason mask. Stencil. Dulce. Dulce. Very nice, very nice. Ooh, Icky hit up. Very cool. Don't see his hand drawn stuff too often. Bunch of little printouts. A pinhead and the mime kind of guy. Another Jason. Definitely hitting the, the Halloween. Well, I'm sorry these sat so long. It is too bad that, uh, you know, I definitely do miss some at times when, uh, you send eagerly after I film a video and then I might not get to film on the next set for a couple weeks or a couple months at times. It feels like it's been two months since I filmed the last set. Just been super busy pushing uh, the last bit of nice weather that I had was getting out and painting pretty frequently. So been enjoying that. So stickers took a little bit of a backseat for a little bit. Oh nice, that's one of those Paisley ones. Really sweet execution leaving the bandana as the Paisley in the character. Would love to see someone piece on top of that and pull a similar vibe. That would be crazy. Oh, Juver Playground with all his characters. Well, nice, we got some of those hollow prints I made for him. Just a subtle touch there. It's always so fresh. Easy E. Some big thermals. Very nice. Juver, much appreciated for the patience, of course. Sending this my way and... Send in a fat stack as well. I'll obviously be sure to happily pass those along to all the trades going out in the next few weeks. I think we should, uh, we got some other big packs here. We even something 3D. And we got some supplies or something in the mix. Yo, my name is Doak. All right, first time sending stuff in. Crew DSKU. We got three members based in Dublin, Ireland. Alrighty, alrighty. And a Lego cap. Oh, he's looking for some blanks and a Lego cap. I don't know that I got any Lego caps on deck right now. But I can see what I can do for some blanks. Alright. Little SNI. SNV hit up. Some DKs. High sives across the board. These guys got rolled pretty gnarly. A nice side hit up. Thank you. Oh, sweet. Gotta love the Montana colors hit. We got D O K O on that guy. Ooh, some sweet side hits. All the way coming from Ireland. Yeah, I think we got a pack from India this month. Ireland. Obviously, Australia with uh, UFO. Dodo. LA. Wow, these are. That's a wide blank. The Dublin Meat Company. <laughs> they must wrap a pack of meat with that. Big brick wall printout. Very fresh. Right on, Doak. Thank you for sending this way. Yeah, we got we got some good representation of the world here. Here, I think this is actually the, the pack from India. Let's give that a look. Really wild mint packaging here. Ooh, and some extra clean interior packing. Let's uh, trim this top off and see what we got. Nice. Oh, bunch of mini packs inside of here. Okay, well let's pick a few of these and go through them. I don't know that we'll have time to open each individually. Straight letters? You got my interest. Duka, D-U-K-A. Very cool. Duka Sive, fresh. Ooh, we got some homemade eggshell prints. Love them, love them. Gotta do what you gotta do. Yeah, let's 
love the character in the backdrop of this one. Characters. That's a fun way to split it. Tell me what's in each pack. His. Boom. These are pretty, pretty clean, pretty fresh. Love them. Right on. Very fresh. Collab, you can extend. Another one of those characters. Right on. We got maybe some blanks in here. In a note. Learn about the artist a little. Hey, Sive, love all, love all the way from India. Right on. I'm only 11 and started doing graffiti two years ago. Hope you like the pack. I tried to add as much variety as possible. All the designs are fresh. Don't have access to spray paint yet. Oh, no. All right. Enjoy. Love the videos. DM'd you earlier saying what's up. Avaho means bye in Guhanti. Ooh, I'm butchering this, which happens to be my mother's tongue. Right on. Thank you very much for the little culture session. And then for trades, you can DM T-A-T-H-A-A-S-T-U underscore 1111. And then uh, we can get trading. Very fresh. Well, Duca, love the styling and love to see you're making it happen. Even though you don't got, you know, easy access to printouts, you're racking them online and uh, printing them yourself. So that, that definitely goes a long way. Let's, let's do one more of these little sets. Let's, let's see the tags. We gotta see. All right, I gotta open all these. These are, I see the top one on each and I feel guilty not showing at least the spread of some. Look at the clean, got an old English text there. Very fresh. Right on on the tags. Can I try to make a character at the end of the stream? We'll see what happens. I, uh, I haven't been working on any characters recently, even though I thought I might have some time and devotion to make that happen. But uh, maybe if we hit a character collab that entices me enough, I can, I can at least butcher it on stream and make a fool of my uh, character abilities. I don't see a note here. Ooh, a little hard to pick the tag out over top of the anime character. But we got some fresh, fresh spray paint track backdrops. Love the purple, pink, silver. You know, the, just the slight hit of metallic goes a long way here. At Turnet, Turn Tech, Goose Labs. A little dense TG. A little dense Instagram name there. Loving the matte finish on these too. And then the, the chrome pop with the tag, that's fresh. I don't know that I got any chrome uh, paint markers on deck to support that collab. Free HK, free Hong Kong. Oh, and then we got some uh, Pokemon card hit ups. Very fresh, very fresh. Loving it, TG. Thank you for the pack. Well, should we do a little break and hit some of these collabs? Seeing as I was just talking about it. I think we got to do the ohm one. That one was uh, keeping my eye. But we are going to be scraping the barrel with some of these old markers. This has just been sitting in my uh, old studio for probably five plus years at this point. Let's, I think we'll be safest with a little yellow to complement this. Let's see how. Oh, we got ink left. That, that's all that matters. Even if it doesn't, uh, even if it doesn't draw perfectly, we can make do with anything coming out at a consistent color. Now, chances are we have like a decent black front outline, probably much slimmer. You can also do a little wave fade there. So maybe we can find a pink to suit it. Yeah, I see some pinks in there. Let's 
to the maybe a question mark. Been doing apostrophes a lot lately. Switch it up a little. Definitely fill it out a little. All right. I see a dark brown. That might be seemingly our best bet here. Sharpies are always the first to go. Ooh, got a mini Sharpie there, but that'll be a little too thin here. Yeah, this will be dark enough. Nice. D. All right, he did a drop shadow 3D. Seems like a decent choice. Nice, nice. Okay, not too bad of a throwy for no warm up. Oh, he did a drop shadow. Yikes. Let's switch that up. Now, hopefully, you won't notice that part's too bad. We're too off the kilter with the rest. bad clean up some of those edges and we said we we're gonna throw a pink in the mix a little pink lemonade flavor here try not to drag some of that brown outline into the mix Nice. No uh, border color here, but I think we could do a light blue if we could come up with one. Yeah. These are some super old Crayolas. Goes to show, materials mean the least. It's all about your time and patience with how to use them. I think I gotta hit the uh, black sharpie to add a touch extra contrast here. So maybe I'll do like a, you know, instead of a white highlight, do a black bold right where uh, you know the darkest shadows would go. That way we can get a little bit extra contrast on some of these edges. I doubt you'll even be able to see these G's on the camera. Yeah, but it'll make me feel like I tried to add a little more contrast as I could. Give me a chance to clean up some of these edges too. No complaints with that. Who knows if that helped. Ooh, no white markers, but we got a colored pencil on deck. We can run that. Can't see it in the yellow, but I'll grind it in there and get a better glimpse of it on the pink. Ooh. 
Actually, not too bad for a little break in the break in the session. I spied a slightly darker Crayola here. All right, that helps so much. I think it's worth the effort here. Gee, I think these are scented too. <laughs> smells like chocolate. Right on. All right, Ohm. Thank you for the collab. Let's get back to some of these packs. A ballpoint sketch on a sticker. That does sound like a fresh, fun way. I don't think I've done a ballpoint stencil and uh, sticker in quite a while. Late to the game. What up? All right, let's check the next pack. Whoa, that is a dense tag. I'm gonna need a cheat sheet to read these. View one on this other one. Could be the same, viewer maybe. It almost looks like O-N-E-K. These are dense. Yeah, this one looks like O-N-E-K as well. Wow. Crazy tag. Love that. Onik? He's Onik. Onik Sav. Crazy lowercase e there. Love the flavor. Thank you, sir. I'll have to take some notes. This tagging... It's, it's dense, but you know, you can read it all all the same, too. Love the double up, too. Gives a little smaller on the first one, a little larger, louder, prouder on the second. Thank you, Onik. We got at... Regelverk, R-E-G-E-L-V-E-R-K. Interesting little characters here. Got the Antichrist cross on top. Regelverk. Little Obey mashup on top. Very nice. I feel like his sticker snuck into a pack last session. Ooh. Stickerville and Regelvac Regelverk. I feel like there you gotta there's a smoother way to pronounce that. Alright, we're breaking into the sticker pack. Seeing what we got in here. Some nice vinyls it feels. So we got sticker vial. Oh, that had me fooled. Looks like the folded edge of a sticker. Very cool. Love that one. Ooh, the astronaut 3D kind of Red and green, love that. Little flying fortress. Sinner hit up. This, ooh, sorry to see that got folded. I'm sure it'll stick fine. Very fresh, very fresh sticker pack. Let's check out the, ooh. Didn't mean to do that. Normally they come off a little easier. Stuck in there, gee. Very fresh. Mini, mini vinyls. Oh, we got Yuko or Yuka. A little scrambled egg. Simpsons. Keith Herring. A lot of mashups. Notorious. Very nice. H&M. 
Loving all of them. High quality vinyls through and through. Regil Verk, much appreciated. Glad to see some stuff firsthand from you as well. Thank you very much. That pass along. Oh, nice. Got everybody's Instagram on the little label here. Vision Ox, Planet Selfie, Flying Fortress, of course, and Sinner, of course. What we got coming in next from a little light blue, crude underscore art underscore. Love the sticker trade videos, new to the graffiti such, new, new to the graffiti stuff, much love, open for trades, and I like skulls. Lovely, fresh little double eyeball skull here. And we got crude tagged on the bottom. Crazy hollow. Skull boy. Crude. <laughs> little icon. Hey, this is Satan, if you're wondering. Skullboy's crude, very nice. Nice printouts. Crude, crude. A little Halloween theme. Very fresh. Of course, fitting of the, the skull sensation. Love the red one on this guy. Excellent, excellent drawings. Love the characters. Love it, love it, crude. Can't say I'm familiar with the work, but I love to see where it goes. What we got up next, why? So we got at just writing underscore why. The heavy pack, a lot of weight to this. Ooh, looks like we got big drawings in there. We got a million dollar note. That'd be fun for a collab. Why well, hit it up himself? Birds aren't real. 2020. A little playoff of Bernie's ad. Heavy Why. These might just be heavy from all the uh, the pain he's putting on them. Why sent in a couple times as well. Very, very smooth execution. Loving it. Loving it. Ooh, big drips in blood over top of the blue. Nice little, uh, I think they were more like a wizard character the last time I saw. Big collabs. Omi sneaking in. More uh, birds. Gotta love the big printout, Vlad and Y. Very fresh Y. Just writing underscore Y. We're coming to the home stretch here. We, we've been making some good progress. I hope everybody's enjoying the uh, little session here. There's uh, plenty of packs to go around. Hope the chat was fun to engage with as well. Hello, Sive. This is classic. I send you some of my stickers and some Sive hit ups. Please give me a little bit of priority stickers with the trade. All right, Gorb. Ah, oh, he did a little Gorb hit up as well. Classic. Classic sent in a few times. Definitely a familiar face in the mix here. Classic. Very fresh on the green. Little couple little white hits on there to add some extra contrast. What up, De Fish? Knowing he he's holding down crude as well. Five hits. Classic. Planet Fitness. Some minis here. Do my best to get a closer view on them. Oh, that's a cool little etch a sketch. Classic, classic. Love a green hello. Ooh, very nice little fluorescent pink side hit up. Thank you. Frog guy. And we got a big, big set here. Ooh, we love that. A little character on top, a little double layer, got a different character in the background. Very nice, classic. Thank you. For the pack. Sai, my first time sending some slaps. I started graph in sixth grade. I'm out of school, but this is not the best. So keep com so help me keep coming up with writing graffiti. Right on. Can you send me some blanks and collabs? Ooh. Side with the splatter on top. Thank you. Uh, Sanoism? S A N O I Z M. Sanoism. Nice. 
Very fresh. King Sano. Ooh, got some acne paint. Maybe a, a Art Primo frequent. Bessie. Always holding it down. His tags are crazy. Metaphor. Also. Always holding it down. And thank you to Sano. Good stuff. What we got here? Ooh. Another clean note on front. Sav, I know there's a competition going on for who your youngest submitting artist is. However, I'm probably the oldest. For, oh, that's fun. Uh, might be exaggerating. I'm 24. I've been writer for eight months, so we just decided to get in the mix. Well, I guess we got to have a competition then for the other side of the coin. We got CRHC. Oh. Let my life without trying to learn a skill. Hey, that's the best way to do it. No, no too late to get into stickers. That is for sure. Instagram is 0333 art. I've included some stickers made in early July. Well, I am late, late to it. These are six months old at this point. So maybe it'll be fun to check in and see, uh, see what 333 comes up with. S E C M maybe. Or yeah, I think that's probably C M Seco. See her Kiko. Psych. A little, little diversity here. Loving it. Ooh, the kind of swampy green on the light blue. Excellent touch. Love that. Scythe hit up on the big hello. Very fresh. Damn. Love that green color on the yellow. Excellent choice. Ooh, crazy character. Kind of a long nose, little scary guy into like a wispy, vomiting body. Funny, funny stuff. Just maybe a little support. On oh, a very kind blank set to pass along. Got some eggs. Maybe a little side shell holographic. Fix penalty notice. Gorilla press. Very nice. That feels fresh. And some hellos. Right around. Thank you, 333. Can see the the artist in here i won't spoil it once we get to it but i know exactly who's that's going to be so we got wavy.nike wavy's also been a prominent face here got some nice printouts on the hollows very clean printed those for him you gotta love it you gotta love it people sending me stickers so i can send them back very nice got some nice collabs here that one's fresh definitely needs a paint marker to be suited well for that I don't think I traveled to any paint markers this time around. And anything here is dried up, so we are probably saving that for later or passing it just right along. More Supreme Blanks from the sea line. Very nice, very nice. I don't those prob are those genuine sea lines? I would be so surprised if they were. Did Supreme drop blank stickers as well? That would be a clash of cultures. Wavy, wavy, so fresh. Thank you, sir. Be sure to go check out his Instagram. Crazy stuff. Hey, Merry Christmas. All right, I called it as tips because I could see his character sneaking through the pack. At tips underscore under, at tips underscore it underscore up. Tips with the mega orange characters. Always keeping me busy sending himself around. Hopefully it does some well advertising for his art projects. Love the character. Big time printout fan. Of course, back to back on the custom prints for myself. The hollows. So clean. Loving it. Mega characters. Lime green touch. Very nice as well. Tips coming in. And the development on this character has been crazy to see. I know I mentioned it before, but literally every time Tip sends in the character, you can just see he's practicing and getting better. Love it. Definitely go check out Tips if you get a chance. Some crazy stuff there and very active in trading. So maybe you can sneak yourself a trade with him as well. What up, Hulk? Ooh, okay, okay. Come on with the hollows. Is this the same okay that 
has the monster throw-ups. Heavy. These, there's some weight to these guys. The Albert Einstein looking fresh. Thank you, okay. Flipping back over to some hand-drawn stuff. We got a big note here. What's up, Sive? This is my second submission. I personally think I improved, so I changed my name to Rascal. Uh, I just kind of messaged, messed around with the names and I think this is the one. Anyways, I was wondering if you could do collabs and return some of them. I'll do my best. It's always hard to coordinate getting collabs done and sent right back to that same pack. Just a couple of tags. Rask, Merry Christmas. Well, thank you, Rask. R-A-S. Oh, that's a pretty nice one. Just real simple with the yellow. Kind of maroon coloring there. Skok? Shock? S-H-O-K, maybe? Ooh, we got John John. Represent. A little Sive hit up. Much appreciated. A little character. Rask. Big donut up top. Right on, right on. Ooh, fresh duck character. Got some attitude there. Ooh, that's a fresh one. Gold hit up. Rask in blue. Wavy dot Nike coming in and the Rask hot dog collab. Got maybe got ketchup the hot dog. Who's about to hit up the mustard? That's fun. That's fun. Thank you, Rask. All right, we're working down to it. Dude. We've hit these packs very quickly and I think all around handsomely. I really like where they're going. Scam.6. Hey, Sob, my name is Sane. My Instagram is S A Y N, the number three underscore six six one dot one. Jeez, you guys don't make it easy on me. Just started writing and made some stickers for you and the other people. Here's a return envelope. Love to see some other stickers to get some inspiration. Some. Sorry, they're not good. No worries at all. Everybody's where they're at. The only thing that I can uh, stake claim on is. You're only going to be better tomorrow if you keep practicing. So who cares where you're at today? Just keep keep the ball rolling. A little psychedelic space scene with some aliens. Sane. These are fun blanks to hit up over top of. A little sp splash a hit. Love the chrome. I'm working on a chrome piece of myself right now. So this, this hits home. Loving it. Sane. The double up. Ooh, some... Just simple pencil goes a long way. Love that. Scam. Very nice. A little jealous the shadow, and that's a fun way to do it. Scene. Love it, dude. Thank you very much for the pack, and best of luck hustling through and uh, making some creative projects. So we got Truffle the Funky Ferret. Oh, forgot this was in the mix. Got a little CD. So, someone best be sending in a priority mail envelope for me to tuff, tuck that in on. Some more Montana Hellos. I think I said I love the yellow Hellos. It didn't have enough. Now I've seen two people send these individually. So, thank you if that was premeditated and trying to help me out and hook me up with those. Love those. Everybody's talking about a, a little Sive Discord. Tell me what those are about. Are they literally just a kind of open message board? I've literally never uh, never gotten into one. Would we? Would that be like helpful if I could do like, if people wanted to trade, they could post on there and people trade addresses and stuff? Or would it be more just a mashup and people talking about sticker art? These are nice vinyls, mind you. So hopefully the, the CD suits well as well. So maybe a, a nice little advertising effort from Truffle. And uh, his uh, Instagram is the same with just some underscores in there. Beat creator, producer, audio engineer, DJ. Well, maybe uh, maybe I'll hit you up and we could get some beats in the videos because I'm always looking for some new artists to, to feature on the, on the, the tune side of things. hangout place a hangout place that'd be cool so just chit chat maybe uh have a live commentary about maybe some critiques and whatnot or just sharing art that could be a good time um 
psychedelic. Maybe I'll have to hit you up. Honestly, I feel like you mentioned it to me if that's offhanded or I'm just superimposing that over top of this. But uh yeah, that could be that could be a good time. I I can't say I've got much time to probably feed into it, but it could be kind of a public forum. I'll maybe maybe I'll look into that while I got some downtime over vacation. My error code is 410. So maybe we're just rocking with 410. Whoa. Oh, canvas print? That's fun. Area code is 410. I like that. I like that. It's clean, simple, has something unique to it. All right. I think you guys have me convinced. I think it, it's at least worth a try, right? I, everything I say with my own art development is you wish you tried it earlier kind of thing. So I don't know. Maybe we should, maybe we should give it a good old, give it a good old college try. Thank you. Dream. My my area code is 410. Whoever you might be, very fresh coloring and styling. Oh, we got a note. Thanks for doing the sticker submissions. I've been watching for a couple years now and finally decided to send something in. Take care, P Timer. Very nice. Sent in from November, so there it is. I'm slow, slow to the game when it comes to answering some of these envelopes. Online black book session. Now that would be fun. Unfortunately, I was hoping I'd be able to do a little bit more streaming recently um, and stream some of my black book work, but haven't uh, haven't really gotten a chance to sit down more than 10 minutes here, 10 minutes there. Um, but I've had fun doing that over vacations and whatnot in the past. Jazz underscore the artist. Jazz underscore the un underscore artist. Message me for return packs. Very nice. Which way we got here? We got the J. A Z Z, cool. Skull character. I feel like I recognize the skull guy a little bit. Nice block print. Nice double up. That's pretty fresh. That's pretty fresh jazz. Nice character. Yeah, definitely recognize. Looking cool. Maybe we got some acrylic backdrop here. You can tell it's kind of almost that soft gritty styling to it. I like it. I don't know. Some people love like a smooth texture. I almost prefer the grime at times. We got P H A S E phase. Love and a lot of flavor on that P. Very nice tag. Stickers by P H A S the number three. So we got at phase underscore slaps with a Z. Very nice phase. And like I always say, um, you know, this stream will go public on the, the channel in a little while. If you send the stickers in or you recognize any of the artists, do a huge favor and drop a comment with uh, people's Instagrams. It's honestly a dog day's work to have me go back. So I probably won't get a chance to go through and try to relink everybody for another week or so. So if you're interested in trading with anybody or interested in know someone's that sent in, do them a solid, send, post their Instagram in the comment section. That way other people can go check them out and uh, even uh, get a link to their trades going because it's a, it's a huge, huge effort for me to go back through and find everybody. But um, it's also a, a really simple effort for you to drop your own Instagram down there and say, hey, I'm open to trades. Even if you didn't send in uh, stickers with uh, this session, it's a great form to do that. Hey, Sive, I've been doing graffiti for a little bit, and I thought I'd send something. Pizza underscore with bees. Ouch. No, thank you. Funny name. Little little character stencil there. Love it. I wonder what the tag is. Pizza with bees. T-R-S-K? Tusk? T-U-S-K? Fresh. Pizza with bees. That's a funny, funny Instagram. See, that one's easy because it's kind of a, a quick sentence saying we got a little package tape here versus people that throw 16 letters in their name and 25 different uh, underscores Wow, love this stencil it's definitely love to see where that goes that that fits so well maybe even throw a slice of pizza in his hand and you got the whole package thank you Tusk and we got the last set here now that, that was uh that was a fun one. I got some collabs to go through so we don't have to break off 
Oh, we got Wrecker to finish it out. He's always throwing stuff my way. Wrecker with the heat tags, very clean. Um, so we don't have to finish it out here, but as always, if you're interested in getting sticker packs my way, I'll have the, uh, the address to send them in in the description of this video after I publish it. That way you can check that out or even check any of the other sticker submission videos. The address is uh, updated in all those. So you can send a, a pack my way, get it featured firsthand, be right next to some crazy artists like Wrecker. Look at that, come on. Killer, killer calligraphy work there. And then, uh, you know, if you also are interested, send a envelope within your pack and a couple stamps on that addressed back to yourself. And that way I'll uh, actually mix match everybody's art that sent in. Let's check this out. Look at that, I probably got 500 stickers now to mix up and mash up and throw these into all the other mix packs. So I've got, here, let me try to get one off hand that doesn't have an address on it. So here we got an example of this. If inside your pack, if you put an empty envelope, I recommend at least three or four stickers. So, I, excuse me, at least three or four stamps so you, I can pack these full of stickers. And then uh, that way I'll actually fill this up with, you know, a handful of Juva Rose stuff, a handful of who we got here. An unknown artist, SKSHK. And I'll send you, I don't know, 20 or 30 stickers mixed up and right back to your address. So with uh, a big old trade service as well. So it's a fun way to get your art physically in my hands and then also get a physical return of a nice assortment. So a little fun uh, community session, I should say. All right, well enough rambling. That's way too many stamps. Psychedelic, you're right. I could probably put a couple markers in that pack. Normally I, I pack a size like that. I think it's three stamps will get you up to like uh, 10 ounces. So three stamps is really good. Four stamps just gives the benefit of the doubt that uh, you know, nothing's gonna get lost in there. Okay, but let's... um. Let's hit some of these collabs. Definitely want to hit one of these backdrops. I like this one the best. And I was I was challenged to do, yeah, where'd that hot dog collab go? Did I? Okay, fresh. I think, should we do the mustard in this mix? Should we do a little mustard can? Let's see what, see what we got for sketching utensils. Cause I don't know that I could freehand that. Maybe we'll do the a mustard bottle and in the backdrop, or how about we do the mustard bottle as the the eye? Let's start with that. We got like a really cylindrical top to French's. That is kind of like a round body there. Okay, that could work, that could work. I'm claiming we do like a pretty simple styling on the letters. No throwy, just like a smooth letter style so we can really flex the mustard session. Well, we should have the mustard kind of splatter out, right? mustard wave going and let's uh yeah let's do a let's do a lowercase e tuck it in there i do see some yellow paint markers this is liquitex and that generally sucks this is a Totally dried out deco. Let's check it. I got a back here to juice on. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Look at that, two hands. That is not gonna juice, promise. Damn. Got some highlighter. Yellow, that's not the right hue though. All right, 
Thankfully, this yellow is dark enough. We'll be able to see it. I was just worried the yellow and the red of the actual label was going to compete a little bit. But an orangey yellow for mustard will, that'll do. We got a proper splash going. Should I do? I feel like I shouldn't do all the letters in this orangey yellow. Maybe we should take some some of that tan as a suggestion. Although I don't, this could be a nice shade for the mustard. Not exactly what I was looking for. We don't have any light tans in here. All of them are just yellow. I don't think pale yellow is going to be... Well, it's going to be dry, first of all. Hmm. It's a complimented tan, if not just a yellow. I guess the darker shades. Oh, that's dry too. What's something that won't fail us? Come on. Here's kind of a tan. Really dark. It's okay. I'll add some deep contrast for us. Do you guys think that brown works, or am I just fooling myself to think dark brown complements the skull lab? I think that would be decently easy to almost make a bevel style here.
and maybe a quick yellow drop shadow. Give it a little something off the edge, a little extra depth. Oh, should probably also do. I think I'm kind of hooked on that uh, white colored pencil. Here it is. I honestly think white colored pencil is a little underrated because you can get some decent opacity with it over top of printed stuff. It won't be a perfect lay, but it'll give you a third shade in the mix. Ah, not too shabby for a freestyle. Little side mustard splat. All right, I wanted to hit this one. What? We do free, little freestyle piece on here. Maybe a little calligraphy. We got we got the Crayola. Might we have something I could do? Oh, this is an old one. Dried to the bone. Just trying to see if we can get a little touch. No idea what marker this is. It's a little clear if we nib. That's decent chances here. I don't remember this marker at all. But I couldn't pick a better time for it to show its face. Do a little, uh, kind of almost get a natural drop shadow with the Crayola on the spray paint. Oh, gee. Oh, smudge the 2020. Oh, we'll leave it messy. That's pretty fun, nonetheless. Oh, it looks pretty good on the camera. Right on. What do you guys think? Anyone else want Sive to do a block letter? I could do a block letter. We've got a... Sano, this, this could fit a block letter. I could rock a block letter next to Sano's collab. Let's, uh, let's sketch it a little. Do, uh, how tight should we get? Oh, we'll give, give Sano some room. Actually, the calligraphy tip would be it's going to be a nice use for this one as well. Love that I found that.
lowercase e or uppercase e? I think we should stick with lowercase. It might fit a little better here. Styling wise, harder to execute. But I'm down for the challenge. Yeah, let's rock that. I realize you guys can't see this at all. <laughs> all right, let's get you a black outline. Well, we should fill it first. What are we doing here? Do a little smear fill. So it actually dries on the thermal. <laughs> this looks funny. Actually leaves a pretty smooth coat here. It's not exactly a block letter, not super blockbuster but a little straight letter styling more fun to do a straight letter too all right now for trying to do smooth calligraphy corners Yeah, my least favorite part of this old desk is that the texture is variable. So sometimes I slip and just drag my hand and the friction is too much and then it gets all wonky. Oh yeah, we're rocking this. I'm eager to put the uh, 3D on these. But I gotta play patient. Finish out this outline nice and smooth.
boys. You can see my strokes so well, I have to like, I think I should actually keep all my 3D as if it's like drop shadowed or even like piano keyed. Just cause you can see the strokes of the 3D so you're gonna naturally already wanna look at it that way. So hopefully it sells the 3D a little bit more. I don't think the 3D is safe enough to smear like I did the fill. Feel the smear under my finger at the E. Nice. I think that looks pretty good. There were no uh, extra hits from Sano. Maybe we just do a. Ooh, I doubt you can even see that pink. Damn. I'll just hit little highlight edge, trying to stay away from the black a little bit. Give us a little shading here, add a little depth. Looks all right, hard to do on that thermal backdrop. Okay, all right. I think I promised an attempt at a character. I feel like I shouldn't wash this, uh, this collab with a potential for a sloppy character. All right, I think the safest bet then would be to uh, maybe hit uh, the eyeballs I've been trying to think. I had that kind of character-esque V I made the other piece. So maybe we could make something styled similar to that. It was kind of just a furry almost... Uh, V, and then the eyeball was kind of the one I've been practicing. Dare we throw a mouth on the mix? few teeth in there. All right, all right, I, this could work. Now I need to be a little bit 
more gracious with this fill. It's a solid collab to start. That sounds pretty empty. Mm, that's pretty dark. What's that color? Ooh, that's a pretty ragged old white deco. Hmm. Well, this pink Elmer's has still got its edge on it. All right, give me 30 seconds to try to juice this up. All right, don't mind me, I have to like really bang this. Damn, that mixing ball is not coming loose. Watch that I've struggled to open a marker. Oh, good. You love when the painters just lose their edge. Yep, still not juiced. <laughs> is not breaking loose. Let's hope the mix is decent. All right, all right. Now let's just hope that it doesn't change halfway through here. I didn't take the time to totally mix it. Wow. It's a pretty good testament. Painters are a little bit underrated. They're obviously not the best paint marker, but they are far better than like the Craft Smart and honestly Sharpie for the most part for what you can get just super accessibly. Well, that's a decent pink right there. All right, we'll definitely have some pink in his eye. Mr. Pink Eye. Damn, this would be the time. I'd really appreciate someone had sent a few paint markers in the mix. Nothing I can't work with though. That coming out pretty fluorescent. Gee, it's not quite as fluorescent on the camera. This is a wicked bright. Hopefully, this doesn't blow out the image too much, but I'm on a slight delay, so stick with me if the change of lighting angle hurts or helps this. Oh, 
Actually, I think it helped a little. This is a paper label, so I don't want to get it too saturated. Okay, cool. Let's do the background. Let's do some just soft purple clouds. Got the light pink. Ooh. Light pink turned gray, just dragging my pencil marks over. That looks cool. Um, uh, maybe we should leave his teeth white. <laughs> Anything you guys want me to rant about while I finish out this sketch? Topics of conversation. Hope everybody had a good holiday and are <clears throat> hopefully getting some good uh, time into your creative endeavors. I know I've been working on a uh, little piece in the backyard. So spray painting a little bit. But it's funny, the, it's so cold here, the spray paint is just literally, after what have I painted for two hours or so, just literally spitting like water. It's just impossible to get us, uh, to get us anything that's decent in coverage. So I had to totally call it off and I'm painting on a saran wrap wall actually. So it's, it's holding up decent day two, but let's, I'm just hoping there's not much wind tonight and because uh, that paint will crack off of it if it gets too tarnished then I'll have to restart <laughs> but otherwise very nice low-key holiday it's been good to just chill relax a little sketch in the black book sketch on here this almost reminds me of like the I don't know if it was, maybe the World Industries had a character that kind of looked like this. Or it was kind of just a little frilly monster dude. Who 
who knows the thousand things that have inspired me at this point. Too much to keep track of. I just really enjoyed freestyling the original letter V and I always thought it kind of looked like a monster with the eyeball in the middle. Do I like Art Primo? Of course. GR always holds it down. I honestly haven't shown them love and support in quite a while. I haven't ordered supplies from them in a bit, but they do a great service. And GR always, with the videos, cracking me up and making a good, uh, good review or two. So nothing but good things to say about them. Actually, I was looking... I can uh, I can stream in 3D or uh, 3D is a little bit stretched, but I hope everybody caught that 360 video I released the other day. Um, I found out that I, I can stream with my GoPro in 360 degrees. Now, mind you, I don't I don't know the best form factor for that, but I was just brainstorming that that would be such a crazy like graffiti jam or art jam. Where you'd have like five or six artists all sitting around the same table, and then you could just pick and pan around and see who you want to see when you're when you're watching. I thought that would make for such a cool podcast or video style. But now is not the time to introduce a big group art project. But just maybe for the future. I know it came here first. If uh, anybody steals my idea before I can get to it, I just think that'd be a really cool atmosphere multiple people that you can kind of pan around and and see a group project or even just a big collab going at the same time if everybody could work on their own portion at the same point that would be crazy Suppose the whole pupil's black. Not sure what that break was for. It's hard to make a circle edge with this calligraphy tip. I guess I do have that fine liner sharpie somewhere. That'd be a little bit of a better tool. Oh no, late to the game, missed out. Yeah, that's the worst part about the post offices. Especially now, it's it's always a gamble that they arrive safely. The Just the small nature of the stickers. I actually had packs arrive and it seemed like people had, someone had taken some of the stickers out of it. It was a pack that had probably like a hundred slaps in it and it showed up and it had like one of the, um, 
one of the plastic entire sleeves taken out, you know, totally missing that. And then half of like the just loose leaf stickers were totally taken out of it. So, you know, it does happen. You do, you can lose stickers in the mix. It's just such a shame when it happens and you really wanted whoever to receive the set. Maybe I don't enjoy characters because they take so much longer to do. Like, I could have definitely busted out a throw. No problem at this point. And there's no cheating it. You really got to take your time to, to make sure it turns out good. I feel like his eyeball needs some color to it. Maybe we do uh, a green to match. What do we got over there? I always forget this dude's name. A E E R Warner. A E R Warner. Anybody know this dude's name? Favorite type of sandwich? I'm like a big, like, either grilled chicken or Italian all the way. But, honest to God, I could eat sandwiches every day of the week. So, catch me on a tuna sub and I'm a happy man as well. I just wish the black was a little bit darker and you can't yeah you can tell on the camera it looks a little washed in there you know it doesn't pop nearly as much as wavies yeah chances are look at that <laughs> there's a reason none of these have been used oh, we got a sharpie sharpie tends to be a touch darker nope on old old craft smart it's not even juiced oh we're juicing Could craft smart come in clutch oh there's no way we'll juice that while we keep looking normally I at least travel with like two paint markers Oh, we're juicing. Okay, I take back everything I said about Craftsmart. If your marker can sit on my bench and work just as poorly as it would off the shelf in Michael's, I can get with that.
Gucci. <laughs> Who would have thought Craftsmart would be holding it down for us right now? And decent coverage. All right, Craftsmart, you win this one. Now the real question is, is it smooth enough to tag with? <laughs> I don't know if I'll take that risk. Ooh. We're cruising. Yep, we needed the paint marker on this. Nice. Craft smart. All right, you got this guy. That, 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 that did wonders for this. I think we should E-miss almost. Maybe say we got some clouds coming over top of the edges here. A little misty. Okay. All right, let's make sure the Sharpie's at least rolling. Or should we, I guess I'll hit. Um, yeah, we could do, do up top. Kind of going to go with the flow and the wisps here. small so I'm not sure how well you guys can see that nice well I think that for a character and seemingly have drawn once I'll count it as once other than this I think we're cruising for that. I think that's a mean, mean add on to this. Dare I add some clouds to everybody else? Yeah, I think we'll leave it as mine. Well, that was a, a heavy sticker session. So once again, thanks for everybody chilling, hanging. Looks like we got a decent crowd for, for the round. You know, 50, 60 people enjoying. The, you, you know, huge thank you to everybody sending in. We got packs from Juver. We got Wrecker. We've got, who else did we have? We had um, 410. What was it? Pizza with bees. Um, yeah, just a huge lot of sticker submissions. Ooh, shouts out for the little dono. Thank you, SF. I've been writing for a bit now and trying to get better and looking forward to seeing some stickers. Good looks. Well, much appreciated from the UK. Yeah, we'd love to see some stickers from there. Um, 
I don't think I had much UK this time around. I had India, had Australia, two Australias actually, and plenty of US. So yeah, UK was a little lacking. I won't forget about the Discord idea. I think that'd be a fun session, have everybody chatting amongst there. Um, fun little collab session to finish it out. Got a little funky with mustard splatters, cursives, and uh, cursives, and a little character sesh. So I uh, hope everybody has a good rest of their break. You might catch me probably not on YouTube a little bit. I'll be lurking on Instagram, maybe post some uh, updates to the speed arts I've been working on in the background. Um, but yeah, all things considered, big shout outs to everybody for keeping the sticker submission series live and healthy. I'll do my best to hopefully keep things rolling month to month, um, in 2021, because we're, we're closing on that. I think this was a good closeout session for 2020. I've got my PO box live and direct, so I'll be sure to update that if you guys want to send my way. I've got a box ready to receive, so we'll be, uh, swapping stickers I now only realizing I've got to pack all these bad boys before I fly home. So I've got all my stickers cut out for me, brought some uh, sticker packs along the way. So I'm going to be packing in the next few days. If you sent in and have a, have a little um, uh, return pack along your way, we'll be, uh, we'll be in the mix and hopefully you'll have a little prize in your mail uh, sooner than later. Big shout out to Wavy as well, holding it down on the double collab hit. Big shout out to Psychedelic. Be on the lookout for that slapper video. That'll probably be my uh, kind of break in the mold. Something really easy for me to edit the first week I'm back in the lab. So be on the lookout for a little bit of a little bit of a quick edit live one take video. That's a fun one. And hopefully the I haven't even reviewed the footage. So I'm saying that on the guys that the footage turned out good. So we'll see about that. I'll uh, catch you boys later and uh, hit each other up on Instagram. Let's see more trades going out in 2021. I don't think it was a stale year, but you know, we can always put more stickers out in the world. It's going to do it for